Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to be discussing the topic of multi-digit subtraction with regrouping. So again, we're going to follow our notepad which has steps on it. So we're going to take a sample question, which is 21 minus 6. So first of all, we're going to be using the notepad, of course. Step 1, arrange the, arrange the numbers using place value. So we'll have to take 21. Minus 6. We are using this in this order because 6 and 1 are of the same place value. 1, 1's place and 1's place. So, first of all, we won't be able to subtract 6 from what is 1 minus 6. It's not, a, it's not there. It's not a rational number. So, we will have to take carry over a digit from the back another place, which is 2. So, we're going to turn this into 1 and turn this into 11. So we will be subtracting 11 minus 6. What is 11 minus 6? 5. And 1, what is 1 minus 0? Since there's no number here, you can imagine it as a 0. So 1 minus 0 is equal to 1. So the answer is 15. So now we'll do another question. Now we'll try a question without regrouping. So we arrange the digits between in order. Now we'll start subtracting from the right to left, the ones, tens, and hundreds, and so on. So one, two minus one, one. Now we'll subtract the two numbers from each other, starting from the ones place. We should regroup if necessary. It's not necessary now. So now we'll continue subtracting until all the repeat the above process until we have add, added or subtracted all the numbers in each place value. So 1, now 2 minus 1 is equal to 1 again. So now we got the answer of 11. Now we're going to try a harder question. So we 2 minus 9 is not possible. So we will get rid of 4, turn it into 3, turn 2 into 12. So 12 minus 9 is equal to 3 and 3 minus 1 is equal to 2 and this is equal to if there's no place you put a 0 and 3 minus 0 is equal to 3. So the answer is 323. Now we'll see 4 digit number divided not subtracted. We'll make add one more digit. 2 2, 2. This is a hard question, actually. If you if you take 1 and you take 1 from this, it will become a 0. This will become 11. So, if we subtract 11 minus 2, it is equal to 9. If you, you cannot subtract anything from 0, hence we take another value from this, make this 0 and this 10. Now we make 10 minus 2 is equal to 8. We repeat the process again until this also turns into a 0 and this turns into a 10. And 10 minus 2 is equal, again equal to 8. Imagine a 0 here, 0 minus 0 is equal to 0. So the answer is 818. Now we'll, get, now we'll uh, learn about a different kind of problem. 2, 0, 0, 3, minus... 20, no, 222. Let's make it 24 for convenience. So we cannot subtract 3 minus 4. So we'll be needing to jump to the next place, which is also a 0. So we'll go to the next place, which is a, again, unfortunately, a 0. So we go to the next place, which is a 2. We turn 2 into a 1, give 10 to this, again, make that a 9, give 10 to this, make it a 9. And we finally make this a 13. 13 minus 4 is equal to 9. 9 minus 2 is equal to 7. 9 minus 2 is equal to 7. 1 minus 0 is equal to 1. Hence the number achieved is this. So now for the final question, we'll be doing 2, 1, 9, 8, minus 1, 9, 2, 3.
we arrange them in the proper place value, subtracting from the right. 8 minus 3 is equal to 5. 9 minus 2 is equal to 7. We cannot subtract 9 from 1. That's how we'll move over. Make this 11 as 10 plus 1 is equal to 11. And 11 minus 9 is equal to 2. 1 minus 1 is equal to 0. And the answer is 275. So this is multi-digit subtraction. And if you learned something in this video and you enjoyed it, be sure to click on the subscribe button below. Bye guys.